Thank you for joining us on Synthesis Workshop. Today is a research spotlight episode, which has been made possible through a partnership with Thema Chemistry, aimed at highlighting some of the great work done by Thema Chemistry Journal Awardees. Today we have with us Dr. Vasudevan Dialan to present some of his work from the group of Anat Milo, who received the Thema Chemistry Journal Award in 2020. Vasudevan completed his bachelor's, master's, and PhD at the University of Madras. His doctoral work focused on Lewis acid-mediated domino reactions and was carried out under the supervision of Professor A. K. Mohanakrishnan. He subsequently worked as a postdoc in Kobe University in Japan in the Hayashi Group, followed by a second postdoctoral stay in the Kanako Group at LMU in Germany, and a third postdoc at Ben Gurion University of the Negev in Israel, where he worked in the Milo Group. Currently, he's an assistant professor and Ramanujan faculty fellow at the National Institute of Technology, Puducherry. And with that, I'll let you get started, Vasudevan. Thank you very much for joining us today. Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Vasudevan Dayalan, currently working as a Ramanujan faculty fellow in the Department of Chemistry, National Institute of Technology, Puducherry, Karakal, India. I am quite happy to join in this synthesis workshop. First of all, I'd like to thank you, Matthew, for your kind invitation. Today I'm going to talk about synthesis of anhydrocyclic carbene and their application of organocatalyst asymmetric synthesis. I hope this episode is interesting for you. In this slide mention 1 to 4 triazole based anhydrocyclic carbene containing source substitutions. On the right hand side, if you introduce various electron donating withdrawing ceric functional group on the rail ring to tune catalytic activity and basicity in various asymmetric reaction. On the left side, replaced by various electron donating substitution containing aryl ring or alkyl group, it's helped to tune catalytic selectivity. Next, I'd like to talk about more detail about benzoin reactions. Cyanide catalyst first benzoin condensation reaction developed by Wuller and Zipik in 1832 via Upolan approach. Recently, in 2009, Zeiler and Kanan reported highly unselective benzoin reaction using under this reaction condition the presence of 4 mole person catalyst. This protocol quite works well simple benzyl ligate, 4 methyl benzyl ligate, and produce highly unselective selectivity and yield. If you look carefully, electron withdrawing substrate like 2 chloro 3 chloro benzyl ligate produce moderate selectivity and yield. Recently, we found solution for this via mechanistic understanding and publishing natural chemistry. Next, I like to show a proposed mechanism of the benzoin reactions. Actually, started from the endocyclic carbon free salt activated by base. Active carbon going to attack first molecule of the aromatic aldehyde or alkyl aldehyde to form this type of acyl anion attack. After proton migration to form well known Brazil intermediate. This nucleophilic Brazil intermediate going to attack another molecule of aromatic aldehyde followed by proton migration and release of the catalyst to form benzoin product. In this slide, mention quick overview of NSA catalysis and amine catalysis. NSA catalysis is widely applicable for various aldehyde. Active carbon react with aldehyde to generate Brazil intermediates. This nucleophilic Brazil intermediate going to attack aldehyde or ketone release of the catalyst to form alpha hydroxy keto compounds. So, next amino catalysis mainly applicable for alkyl aldehyde uh, to generate enum intermediate. This nucleophilic intermediate going to attack aldehyde over ketone to form aldehyde alpha carbon functionalized derivatives. This slide mentioned quick overview and general method for synthesis of chiral anhydrocyclic carbon. This synthesis started from commercially available pyroglutamic acid undergoes by esterification, Greek knot reaction, cellulation, methylation, hydrogenation, ring cyclization, and deep production of cellulose group to form anhydrocyclic carbon with OH group. Actual synthesis started from the pyroglutamic acid. First step in the presence of thionyl chloride methanol to form ester. This ester reacts with two molecules of Greek knot reagent to form tertiary alcohol. This OH group cellulated in the presence of two six rutidine and TBS triplet. This protected collector undergoes one part three step reaction and produces a desired OH cellulated anhydrocyclic carbon in good yields. Recently, we reported our improved method for synthesis of various types of anhydrocyclic carbon having OH group. Using our method, we can easily synthesis up to 8 to 9 gram in one batch. So far, this is one of the best methods synthesis of anhydrocyclic carbon having OH group reported by Zeiler and Kanan, clearly showing the difference between reported method and our method. In additionally, in organocatalytic catalytic reaction, BF4 minus ion play crucial role for this purpose. Bromine and 
counter ion exchanged by BF4 minus in the percentage BF4 ETH rate. Next, I like to show you how to synthesis of Lester Kinder Indotocyclic Carbene having OH group and protein group as well. The synthesis originally started from pyroglutamic acid, panel chlorine media stratification for sodium reduction to give primary alkyl. This alkyl OH group is actually protected using the acyl group in the presence of the imidazole and acyl chloride. So, followed the protected lactone successfully applied into one part of this protocol to give various endotocyclic carbenes. Using our method, we synthesis list of endotrocyclic carbon having alternate donating and withdrawing substitution and various functional groups in good to IELTS. Endotrocyclic carbon containing silyl group was successfully cleared in the presence of HBF4 etherate. This method offers synthesis of various endotrocyclic carbon having OH group. This OH group quite important for the functionalization of organocatalyst. We performed few control experiments to understand in this reaction. So we took OTMS catalyst as a model substrate in the presence of HBF4 etherate. So entry 1 without rithyl orthoformate DCM 40 degree centigrade 1 hours 2 forms 100% of catalyst 7A. Entry 2 80 gram of rithyl orthoformate DCM 40 degree centigrade 2 form 100% of recover back starting material. Entry 3 without rithyl orthoformate, chlorobenzene 110 degree 1 hours. So we observe 59% of catalyst 7A. Now entry 4 80 gram of rithyl orthoformate, chlorobenzene 100 degree centigrade for 1 hours. So we observe 25% of starting metal, 75% of OH catalyst. Entry 5 without rithyl orthoformate, chlorobenzene 120 degree for 15 hours. We observe 100% of catalyst 7A dash. Recently, we reported efficient method for synthesis of an highly enhanced selective benzoyl and product containing electron withdrawing substrate on the RL ring 3 and 4th position, such as chlorobromide, cyanide, etc. Notably, this method is in situ modification of organocatalyst. So, we started from endotrocyclic carbon having OH group, the addition of RL boronic acid, so by an uncovalent interaction to form NSC boronic acid. In generally, some other group to optimize the reaction, they are required. Uh, different base, different catalyst, different temperature, etc. etc. Our method is quite efficient and simple because we start from one catalyst adding different type of RL boronic acid able to uh, get ion selective benzoin products. Recently, we reported first time for ion selective benzoin product in large scale 7 gram 50 millimole reaction in the presence of endotocyclic carbon 0.1 mole percent and boronic acid. Using this reaction condition, CF3 boronic acid gave low yield, high selectivity. 4 methyl boronic acid gave same selectivity, improve the yield. 2 for dimethyl boronic acid gave good selectivity and yield. This low loading organic acid approach quite interesting, applicable for synthesis of cancer drug and insecticide. Also, we can be able to synthesis alpha hydrox beta keto ester analog um, via intramuscular benzone reaction to synthesis induxa car. Coming to the end, we synthesis pyrrolidine based enetrocyclic carbon having OH group. In addition to that, also we synthesis two different type of enetrocyclic carbon. One is steric, another one is less steric. The steric type enetrocyclic carbon synthesis for mixture will pyrrolidine carriage in HF with high yield. We obtain enetrocyclic carbenes can be further functionalized as hydroxyl until to extend library of organocatalyst. Enetrocyclic carbon OH organocatalyst may be broadly applicable for various organocatalyst asymmetric reactions. Thank you for tuning in for this research spotlight episode, and thank you to Fosu Devon for sharing your work with us. Thank you as well to Team of Chemistry for making this episode possible. If you enjoyed the episode, you can support us by subscribing and telling your peers about this podcast, and feel free to send us any questions or comments you have. Follow us on Twitter to stay up to date, and see you all next time.